I'm Jamie McDonald. Join me as we celebrate small businesses that make New York so unique. These New York Originals. There's something to be said about a sandwich shop that's been able to survive in Manhattan for over 80 years, especially one that's located in the Flatiron District, a place where everything can be oh so last week. But Eisenberg Sandwich Shop has done just that by offering classic sandwiches at great prices for generations. It's cozy, people are friendly, and uh, you get a very sort of diverse crowd in here, keeps it interesting. With the iconic Flatiron Building reflecting in its sign, Eisenberg Sandwich Shop has quietly become a local legend by offering people two simple things, good food and good company. There's nothing else that makes this area feel like a neighborhood but Eisenberg's. Everything else are chains. And Eisenberg's skinny interior looks straight out of an Edward Hopper painting or a film noir movie. Classic original fixtures abound, like dark wood paneling, steel diner stools, and even gas-fired coffee makers. Eisenberg's was opened by Carl Eisenberg in 1928. The family ran it until the 1960s. After a couple more owners, Josh Konecki came in. Uh, the business I was in before was tanking and uh, had to do something. I always wanted to get into the food business. And having been a customer here, I always liked Eisenberg, so I bought it. Oh, I, I certainly wasn't going to change the name. Everybody knows this is Eisenberg's. So now I, I really do feel like right now it's my turn to look after this. Eisenberg's is far from just a nostalgia trip. But you don't survive in New York City on quaintness alone. Ultimately, it's the quality of the food, actually, as, 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 as fun as the old place is, the quality of the food that really distinguishes Eisenberg's. But this place is about two things. Matzo ball soup, chocolate egg cream. That's what I come here for. I've been coming here for 30 years. It's for the food. That's what Eisenberg's is about, my man. It's simple food done right. I mean, really, all our sandwiches, every sandwich is made to order. Uh, a lot of these places, you go in and you point to something in a case, and you say, I'll take that, and I'll take that. Uh, we, we do nothing pre-made. So, you know, people, it's funny, people will come in, especially younger people, they'll come in and they'll say, so what comes on the chicken salad sandwich? And I say, whatever you want to put on the chicken salad sandwich. I'll put chocolate syrup on. I don't care. But we don't have a big walk-in. We don't have a lot of space. So things come in fresh every day. We fresh brew iced tea, which it's funny because a lot of people will say, do you have iced tea? And I'll say, yeah. And I'll go to port and they say, oh no, I, you know, Snapple. And I'm like, no, we don't sell Snapple. We have fresh brewed iced tea. And if the food wasn't enough to keep them coming back, Eisenberg's also gives street-worn New Yorkers a dose of small town community amongst a tangle of skyscrapers. You know, it's like a community. People come here, we know their name, they know us, and it's like, uh, yeah, special. Typically, people come in and they just feel sort of sucked in, and they just love it, so. And why wouldn't they? Tasty food, good conversation, in the greatest city in the world? That's why people love Eisenberg's, generation after generation. And so many people will come in here and say, don't, don't go out of business, stay where you are, hang in there. And I said, look, you're doing your part, thanks for coming in and, and keeping this institution alive. Uh, when I first took the store over, uh, customers, customers said, oh, you're going to change it. And I said, no, I'm really not, I'm just going to clean it up a little. And they were like, not too much, not too much, don't clean it up too much. So, I, I mean, I know that's what people like, something that's old New York, which I think is really important. There's so little of old New York around. And um, I sort of feel like I'm doing my part to keep it alive. Eisenberg's isn't just known for their sandwiches. They also serve a mean breakfast that includes cheese omelets and even grits. They open most mornings at 6.30 a.m. and close at 8.30 p.m.